Well, the big question yesterday, was it fog or was it a smoky haze? The answer is actually both. So as we start our morning, as we look across the Ohio County traffic camps, we're actually in both. Pretty dense fog across, especially those low elevations. You notice that like as we look across the Fort Henry Bridge, you can see what looks like clouds trying to move across it compared to if we were just seeing haze, we would just stay still. So we're seeing pretty dense fog to start the morning, mainly for those lower elevations. But like as we look up towards the highlands, just unfortunately stuck with that haze. So especially if you're traveling along route two, route seven this morning, that's where we're really noticing the fog the thickest this morning. It's not a bad idea to give yourself a couple extra minutes as you step out the door to make sure you leave plenty of space between you and the cars around you. Fog though doesn't stay with us for too much longer. That likely only stays until sunrise as we'll start to see it mix out. But unfortunately, because of that fog, we are noticing that air quality much more unhealthy this morning since there are more particles in the air. Much of the valley still in that very unhealthy the hazardous range, but there is no hope. Look across parts of western Pennsylvania and now parts of northern Ohio. We are seeing the air quality trying to improve, and we're also not seeing that smoke as thick as it was yesterday. What we're seeing across parts like Michigan and Illinois where it's yellow is what we were seeing yesterday. Now it's just in that brown, that light range, and likely continues to dissipate throughout the day. So our worst air quality is this morning when we should see improving conditions throughout the day today. So early this morning, actually much of this morning, in the first half of the afternoon, really try to limit your outdoor activity. If you want to get a walk in, really best to save it until later on, mainly towards dinner time and on this evening. But we should see improving conditions come our day tomorrow. Going to notice the return of those very warm temperatures, likely getting up to 86 here in Wheeling, with our cool spot of 84 into Bongeville, as well as Woodsfield, and our warm spot of 88 into Moundsville and up into Chester. So going to notice things very warm, very humid, and we'll even see a few more pockets of sunshine, mainly as we head towards the afternoon. So as we start the morning, though, stepping out the door at 6 a.m., noticing a little bit of some clear, but we see these clouds likely rolling throughout the morning. But by the time we get to the afternoon, we'll see things try to clear on up. So by noon, lunchtime, seeing partly cloudy to mostly sunny skies, but sunshine, high humidity, and warm temperatures will likely leave for a few showers and storms to pop during those afternoon and evening hours. But by the time we get to 11 p.m., trying to see some of it, trying to clear out of the area, but notice how spotty it is. So unfortunately, a few of those storms could be on the low end of severe. Anything would be strong because of that. Storm Prediction Center has put much of the area in a marginal risk for tomorrow and even on that likely continues for day on Saturday. Not everyone will see these storms. Anything remains pretty spotty and any of those storms are spotty. Likely anything is more of an isolated threat. So any storms that do pop up could bring some heavy downpours, maybe some gusty winds and hail no larger than the size of a pea. And that activity unfortunately likely sticks with us through our Sunday as well. So just stuck with the haze today. Proving conditions, but a stray pop-up shower and thunderstorm, mainly for the afternoon and evening hours tomorrow. Best chance for rain and storms, though, will be likely Saturday and Sunday. A few showers try to continue into early Monday morning, but we should see skies clearing throughout the day, leaving us with sunshine both for our day on Tuesday and for our day on Wednesday.